Here we go. Standby Q billion kit. Standby camera one. We're live in five. Standby camera four. four three. Camera two, two has two shots. One. That's Chelsea Kane from Dance with the Stars last night looking flawless. The lady responsible for that look is Melanie Mills, head makeup artist for Dance with the Stars and a paid spokesperson for Anastasia Makeup. Melanie's here to show us how to make the ballroom look work for every day. Melanie, welcome. Thank you. Hello. I love looking at the looks on Dancing with the Stars. What's your biggest challenge? I would say just having to come up with different looks for everybody every single show, every single season. Because I've been on for five years and we've had, what, already 12 seasons. And just to come up with different looks all the time and make it look fresh and beautiful and fun is probably the biggest challenge. All right. Well, there's a bunch of different looks, I think, that go with the dances. Let's start. What do you do for the ballroom look? Well, the ballroom look, one of the biggest things is a nice, fleshy, beautiful cheek. And when one of my signatures is always using a cream first, so I, I'll just like lay down a cream like this. Now, so there's foundation, then you do the cream. Yeah. So I'll, I'll put the whole foundation on. Cheeks is kind of one of the last things I do. I typically do eyes first because I want the focus to be on the eyes. And then that way I use a lot of pigments and a lot of shadows and it falls and I'd rather have the face be clean anyways. So I work in like a cream blush, like this uh, Anastasia Highlighting Duo. I love this. So what's this called? And I like the cream. It looks so um, dewy as yeah. opposed to matty. I love dew on the show because to battle all the costumes which are shining and full of rhinestones, you know, I just love to have the shine all over the body, all over the face. And this is a great way to achieve that. And then also within this is this fabulous little highlighting cream. Oh, cool. And you just use just like a touch. Oh, this is great. And then you just work it back in. I love it. It's so youthful and fresh looking. And then I still pop a little color on top of it just to kind of give that little added. You got a little color. <laughs> oh, and then a little of the pink on top. Yeah. All right, great. All right, we got the cheeks. That's so nice. All right, the cha-cha. Yes. Usually with the cha-cha, is it all about the eyes? I think so. It's all about sexiness. It's all about, you know, bronziness. It's all about, you know, a smoky, beautiful, beautiful eye. All right, show me how to get this. Great job, Cheeky. All right, now see the lashes. You're big on the lashes, right? Huge on the lashes. We typically do um, between one and four pairs of lashes per show. Wow. We'll cut them up. We'll use them up. Last night on Kendra, we did something really fun where we used plastic iridescent underneath a pair of uh, other false lashes. Wow. I wanted to give her like a firework feel because of the whole Fourth of July thing or the Americana thing. But definitely, I'm going to go in your eye, honey. You want to definitely smoke it out by going in the eye. In the eye, so the inner eyelid. Yep. And the you're water using line. the liquid with that. I'm using a gel liner which will last you all day long. It's a little trippy at first to apply it with a brush in your eye like that, but once you do it, you're there all day. Tears, whatever, it'll stay. What about the line on top? The line on top, I'll do a mixture. I'll do like a little of the the gel, but then I like to go on top and smoke it out with shadows. Okay. Ooh, on, that looks so good. This is a beautiful palette from Anastasia that's got all these great, perfect cha-cha colors. Right, what's the key to smoking it out? Well, I like to take a little shimmery bronze and just kind of go on top and just buff it out a little bit. So that way you don't have such a hard line. And I also like to go underneath. Look up for a minute. Oh, the under. Learn all kinds of tricks. Yeah, that way it also makes the eye look a lot bigger, especially when you're using so many lashes. All right, great. I love the eye. Okay, so we got the cheeks, okay. we got the eye. For the jive, is it all about the lips? The jive is definitely one of the things about the jive is the lips for sure. It's a fun, retro, typical dance. And so we like to really Let's pop see. up the lip. We're going to pop up your lips. You cool with all that? Right. I am fine with that. Now, the red's a little tough. It's been red and a lot of pink, which I like. Yeah, last night's show was really all about red Americana. I wanted lots of red lips. But for her, for this look, for just like the everyday that you can bring home, too, um, you know, definitely line the entire lip okay. with a lip liner. Good trick. And that's a bed head, more of a pinky. Yeah, I want to go real poppy and bright. The jive is fun and fast and poppy and bright. It's just, you know, so, you know, you just want to have fun with your makeup with the jive, for sure. I, there is a retro twist to it, though, like a 50s kind of feel a lot of the times. So, but for today, we just did this real fun so you bright. you the liner everywhere and then the gloss on top? And then the gloss. Oh, I like that. Great stuff. All right, I like it. The good lips, great dances, models. You look great. Melanie, 
You're doing a good job. Nice Thank to you. meet you. Thank you so much. For more information on Anastasia Beverly Hills, log on to Anastasia.net. And for daily beauty updates on Dancing with the Stars, looks, go to Facebook.com slash Anastasia Beauty. Got it. Straight ahead, Hellcat's hot mom.